Coach Riley lands that big fish that he's been after. Hi, everybody. Greg Peterson here along with Nate Klaus. Nate, um, it's a big day for Nebraska right now. You know, Coach Riley gets Keyshawn Johnson Jr. He uh, announced his commitment today on a video, a Bleacher Report video. Uh, you know, talk about what this means to Coach Riley and his staff. Well, a monster pickup for Coach Riley in Nebraska. Uh, big recruiting battle won here. You're talking about a kid who's USC legacy, um, you know, and then you're beating Alabama, Clemson, Ohio State uh, for, for one of the top receivers in the country, a top 250 prospect overall in the nation. So, uh, you know, absolutely huge addition to the class. They spent a lot of time uh, recruiting him and, and putting a lot of time and effort in, in making him a priority in this class and to, to finally capitalize on it this early in the in the process is a, a big step for the Huskers. Johnson Jr. is ranked a four-star prospect by Rivals.com. And Nate, you and I had the pleasure of seeing him play last year in person. You know, just give us your thoughts on what you've seen from him on the field. Well, he's a tremendously polished uh, wide receiver. He's a kid who runs great routes, has tremendous hands, uh, and is afraid not afraid to do the dirty work. He, he's a kid that goes over the middle, makes tough grabs, you know, when he knows he's going to take a shot, uh, and, and is has a bigger body at 6'1", 195 pounds, uh, uh, to take those shots and to, to break tackles after the catch. And I think that's something that he's going to be able to, to give Nebraska and, uh, and probably be uh, um, you know, able to block on the perimeter and do all the things that a wide receiver needs to do in this offense. But you know, maybe the biggest impact with this commitment, though, is what's going to happen down the road. Um, you know, he's got a lot of close ties in California with a lot of big name players, um, which he's, you know, he's shared his uh, love with Nebraska with, and uh, they've kind of reciprocated. Yeah, we, we all know that, uh, you know, it's been well documented uh, that he's, you know, teammates with Darnay Holmes, a five-star cornerback, uh, Tristan Jebby, obviously the four-star quarterback there at Calabasas, but also has a lot of ties to, you know, a lot of the other uh, elite prospects in the state of California and, and really uh, some other elite prospects across the country. And with his commitment, uh, I think that signifies – uh, Nebraska is a real player in this in this 2017 class, and they're going to be able to to capitalize on this and, and recruit a high level of athlete going forward. and And kids are going to take notice of Keyshawn Johnson Jr. being in this recruiting class. Going to want to see what Nebraska is all about. So, um, you know, maybe the most interesting aspect of this is now Nebraska has two four-star wide receivers committed to them uh, with Keyshawn Jr. and uh, Javon McQuitty out of uh, Columbia, Missouri. So. Uh, that's that's got to be kind of enticing for a quarterback, um, you know, to, to be able to step into a class that has two highly rated uh, wide receivers, um, you know. So that's something to keep an eye on going forward is that quarterback recruiting now. And, and you know, keeping that that California pipeline open is really important. We also caught up with rivals West Coast analyst Adam Gordy to get his thoughts on this commitment. The commitment of four star. Keyshawn Johnson Jr. to Nebraska is important for many reasons. One, he's a talented receiver who's going to be a nice addition to that offense. But two, uh, he's going to be able to recruit a lot of guys uh, from Calabasas and from Southern California to the Huskers, and that's really important. He has teammates that are very serious about Nebraska, four-star quarterback Tristan Jebbia, five-star cornerback uh, Darnay Holmes, and then, you know, really the, the continuing commitments of California players to Nebraska – will help Mike Riley and his staff be more successful in the state. So getting Lamar Jackson last year, now landing Keyshawn Johnson Jr., it's becoming more normal uh, for California kids to look at Nebraska and then be very serious about them as their as the recruitment continues. You know, it's kind of funny if you see, you know, some of these national interviews and stuff with the players like Darnay Holmes where, you know, usually it would be all West Coast schools and, you know, the first thing that people are asking them is about Nebraska, you know, it, and we haven't seen that around here in a long time. Yeah, it's been a long time since Nebraska has been a legitimate contender uh, for the type of talent on the West Coast uh, that we've seen over the last class with Lamar Jackson. Uh, now this class with Keyshawn Jr., Darnay Holmes, Tristan Jebbia, and so forth. So, um, you know, for them to, to be able to, to kind of – uh, implant themselves in with and put themselves in good graces with a lot of these players is pretty exciting to see and it's going to be really you know intriguing to see how everything unfolds going forward well we'll have plenty more you know on this big time commitment on husker online nate's going to have plenty more coverage coming up so stay tuned in to huskeronline.com